Today we are going to be installing the Bison Gear shelf and panel set for the 5th gen 4Runner. The set comes with two panels for the back rear windows. You can buy the panels just by themselves or you can get the whole set which comes with the shelf. Each panel comes with its own stainless steel hardware. So first we're going to be removing three covers. The first one is in the back by the hatch and you'll just want to remove the screw that's inside there. The second one is below the window. You will just pop it out from the bottom and take the screw out as well. Then you'll want to remove the hook that is above the window. You'll just pop that open and remove that bolt. Next we're going to take this wing side piece. You'll want to put two screws in there. Just make sure you don't tighten all the bolts so you have room for adjustments later. I take the top bracket and place it on the rear of the panel and then screw those three screws in. Then you're going to want to take this small rubber piece with a screw on it and install it onto this hole right here. My Forerunner, the hook has this long piece on the back side and you'll just want to cut that off and sand that down. Using my leg to help me lift the panel, put the top bracket back behind the hook. Now this is just preference, but the, the kit does come with its own bolt, but the bolt that came with my Forerunner seemed more sturdy, so I just used that one instead. Next, we're gonna take this medium rubber piece and stick it in the back hole by the hatch, and then you'll just wanna hand screw that in. The last rubber piece is the longest one, and just like before, we will place the rubber piece in the back and then put the screw in. Next, once you have everything done, you'll wanna tighten all the screws. I tested it myself and made sure <laughs> this thing is not moving. Now the most exciting part, we're going to put the shelf together. Now there are holes where you will see where the brackets line up and you will just decide how high you want your shelf. Me personally, I wanted to make it as high as possible, so I just used the three holes at the top. This is kind of the cool part. We're going to take this long piece and stick it on the shelf. So this part is the barrier um, preventing anything from falling. Moment of truth, we're going to take the shelf and slide it from the back seats onto the brackets and towards the hatch. And the last part, you're just going to make sure it's lined up with the holes and then install those last screws. And that's it. It's a fairly easy install and I'm so happy with the end result. 